A correctly fitted point shoe encourages confident dancing and promotes a long and healthy relationship with point work. In a shoe as customizable as Gainer Minden, make sure to assess all elements of the size code to find your ideal fit. A minimal break-in period means you should love your fit right from the start. While nothing can replace the experience of an in-person fitting, together we'll review how to check your fit at home. Remember to try on all new shoes with full-footed tights on a clean surface, as we can only accept returns and exchanges in like new condition. You'll need a clean pair of ballet tights or fitting socks, a clean surface to stand on, and a mirror nearby. Put your new shoes on and tighten the drawstrings by pulling in line with the drawstring casing. Tie them in a bow that can be easily untied. Notice that we have not added padding yet. Try without padding during your initial size assessment as you can always add it back in later. Start by standing in first position. As you demi-plie, your toes should lie flat and gently touch all surfaces of the shoe, including the platform, without any discomfort. Next, place one foot on point and pinch the material at the heel near the drawstring casing. There should be 1 8 inch to 1 quarter inch, or 3 to 6 millimeters of excess material. Unlike traditional point shoe satin, Gainer Minden satin is designed to support and will not stretch over time. Gainer Minden width refers to the area of the shoe across your metatarsal and midfoot. The satin should hug this part of the foot, yet still allow the toes to slide into the box comfortably. The box is the part of the shoe that encases your toes. We offer five different boxes ranging from very tapered to broad and square. The box should fit snugly, yet still allow your toes to lie completely flat without any overlapping. To check both box and width, start by standing flat and parallel. The satin should appear smooth without any creasing or gaping around the metatarsal. If you feel pressure on the tips of your toes, this could be a sign that your box is too large. A box that is too large can lead to blisters, bruises, and the feeling that you're sinking when up on point. Next, step up on point. In the correct box and width, you will feel lifted, secure, and supported. The satin should still appear smooth around your metatarsal without any bulging or wrinkling. The shank is the part of the shoe that supports the bottom of your foot when on point. We offer five different shanks ranging from very flexible to very stiff. To make sure your shank offers the right combination of support and pliability, test your demi point and roll through. Your demi point should be articulate and your roll through should be graceful and smooth. If you feel like you are popping up to point, your shank is likely too stiff. Gainer Minden shanks and boxes are made from a flexible molded insert that never weakens or breaks in, so make sure yours is pliable enough right from the start. Step up on point to examine your vamp height and heel height. The vamp prevents your foot from arching too far forward when on point. A vamp that is too long will keep the foot from balancing squarely over the platform. With the help of ribbon and elastic, the heel keeps the shoe on your foot. It should feel secure while also creating a flattering line and should never look baggy. The model determines the overall shape of the shoe from the metatarsal to the heel. Standing in first position, the shoe should hug the sides and heel of your foot without any excess material. If you are wearing the correct length, width, and box, yet notice gaping, wrinkling, or squeezing along the sides of the shoe or at the heel, you might consider a different model. Each of the three models fits a general foot shape. Classic is more rectangular, while sleek is more triangular, narrowing toward the heel. 
Sculpted is shaped like an hourglass, trimming in at the midfoot. If you have determined that your shoes fit correctly, now is the time to make sure that they are also as comfortable as possible. Gainerman and Point Shoes have some built-in cushioning. Less is more when it comes to additional padding. Keep in mind, if you choose to wear a toe pad, you might need to adjust your Point Shoe size depending on its thickness and shape. Remember that your feet are not identical. Consider customizing padding specifically for each foot. Our fitting accessories can help you further customize fit. Best practice is to show your new shoes to a teacher or coach for approval. You should only sew your ribbon and elastic once you are 100% happy with the fit. If you have any questions at all or your shoes don't fit as expected, our fitting experts are always happy to help. Don't hesitate to email, call, or schedule a virtual fitting appointment on dancer.com. Happy dancing!